up y'all welcome back to our channel we have an aldi grocery haul today i'm going to show you guys so we'll start over here we got fresh face cloth um kylie is definitely going to use this because she likes to take care of her face and i don't blame her because it's really really soft so i'm also going to use these this is really really good <laughs> they're um, microfiber i believe um forgot how much it costs but it was a good price so the um aldi local aldi check it they might have it um, these are the best things since sliced bread. I've never used these growing up, but you just, if you haven't used them before, pop it open, put the little mop on it, folds right over, locks into place, easy. So we got these. Um, it's super fast and easy to use. And it comes with 42, no, 12, my bad, 12. <laughs> I thought it was 42. But it lasts a long time, and they're really, really um, convenient. So we got our bread here. We're going sticking to the whole grains trying to go as dark as possible to reduce um, any added sugars, um, which we have two here. So one slice gives you two fat, um, 21 carbs, and five protein. So it's not bad, but it's a lot better than white bread. So we got that. Um, we are celebrating Kylie's birthday. Yeah, she turned 21 again. So we got some Burwood Cellars Brutes Sparkling Champagne. So super excited. I'm um, going to put this in the fridge and just a wee little bit here. A wee little bit. <laughs> Got some crispy rice because we're going to make some rice crispy treats. So we're gonna, definitely going to use this along with some mini marshmallows. So we're excited for that. That's going to be our pre-workout snack. So you'll probably see it on my stories on Instagram soon. So we got some zucchini. We love using the zucchini to put into our um, like little morning breakfast scramble with some eggs and some mushrooms, which you see here. We got some sliced white mushrooms. So we use our dicer and dices it right, right up perfectly for us. Got some mandarin oranges for literally everybody because JJ loves her oranges. And it's also a really good snack to just have on hand during the day. So perfect. Got some bagel skinnies. All right. These are, I haven't had this particular brand, but I have, it's been a long time. But the serving size is one bagel, um, only one fat, which is pretty good. 23 grams of carbs and four grams of protein. So it's only 110, like I said, for one bagel, which is really, really good. And so it kind of curves that bagel craving if you have it and feel good about yourself. Got some pita bread. I think we're making some, um, What's it, Savaki? Yep, that's happening tonight. So, got some pita bread. Um, so, a half a pita is one serving size, or is this a serving size? For 90 calories, 18 grams of carbs, 4 grams of protein, and look, no added sugars. So, that's what you want to look for when you're reading these labels. If it's including added sugar, you kind of want to stay away from it the best you can. Just remember to say that the best. It's kind of hard these days. <laughs> All right, yeah. The eggs, we got, we got the eggs like nobody's business. This is probably gone within the next couple of days. So we got two um, dozen. JJ loves her little applesauce squeezables. So we got some apple peeps. I don't think she's had this flavor yet. So super excited for her to try it. No fat, 13 carbs, only three added sugar. So not bad. And if you look at the ingredients, it's not a lot of ingredients, which is really good. So the less ingredients, the better. Um, so yeah, it's for little JJ. Got some chicken breast we're going to cook up. Um, price of chicken is, you know, how that goes. So, what are you going to do about it? All right, get some three cheese tortellini. I think these were on sale, but we love tortellini. Um, this is a marinara sauce, sprinkle of Parmesan cheese. Looks so good. I cannot wait. Um, one cup is one serving for 280 calories, seven fat. Um, 40 carbs, no included sugars, and 12 protein. So this is, you get a bang for your buck with this. I'm not going to eat a whole cup of this, for sure. <laughs> Probably like half a cup. That'll fill me up right away. Um, get some Mexican-style cheese, because it's the best thing to go on literally everything. So we love that. If you have not tried these yet, y'all, these are the cheese fries. How I think it's pronounced halu, halumi. If I don't know how to pronounce it, but it's style cheese sticks. You can grill or fry, they're gluten-free, keto-friendly. Y'all, look at this. Seven fat, two carbs, seven grams of protein, no added sugar. Look at those ingredients. That's it. 
this is the real deal. There's different ways you can cook this. It says you can uh, deep fry them, you can pan fry them. I made them before, I did it on the pan, um, some oil, and it came out really, 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 really well. So um, I would definitely recommend doing that versus deep frying to avoid any extra calories. But these are amazing. So cheese fries. Um, we got the portable tire inflator because JJ's stroller tires get flat, you know, pretty quickly. Plus, this is really safe to have on hand, especially when in the car with a child. <laughs> so because the LED light on it, internal organizer for the cables and spare parts, which is pretty nifty. And it has three different adapters. So it's like you can pump up balls with that too, like a basketball or volleyball. Um, tells you the inflation power right there. So in case you want to know, you know, 915 cubic inches per minute, I guess is pretty good for a portable charger or a portable air inflator, tire inflator, sorry. There you go. Cool. Um, got some kiwis. Jalen has not had kiwis before, so we're going to try that. And haven't had them in a long time either. So, um, kiwis, it tells you right there, more potassium than banana, more fiber, more vitamin C than an orange, and more vitamin E and K than avocado. So, in case you don't know, growing up, I thought vitamin C, the best way to get it was in oranges. That's a lie. Okay, literally everything has more vitamin C than an orange, so especially kiwis. So, I cannot wait to get into these. Um, turkey breast for a day for lunch, and also for me for lunch. I love my little turkey breast. 98% fat free. Yeah, yeah. Get some pure Irish butter. We're going with the Irish butter recently because they literally aren't filled with any other ingredients um, or any oils. The ingredients are literally cream and salt. So I love it. Sign me up. We got some tzatziki sauce that we're going to have later on with our pita bread. Um, this is amazing. Tzatziki with Greek yogurt. The serving size is two tablespoons, 40 calories, 3.5 grams of fat, two carbs, and one gram of protein. So this is really good to use for like a dip for like cucumbers or cucumber, I probably say cucumbers, carrots, <laughs> um, or even some crackers too. Got some sweet relish that we're gonna use probably for some egg salad this week, most likely. I mean, pull it up. There we go. The no fat, which is super, super nice. Only three added sugars, but it's sweet relish, so I mean, what are you gonna do? All right, I've been trying to find beet juice for a long time. Couldn't find it, but this works for now. So cold press, I'm gonna try this later on today. All juices, I'm super excited to try that one. It's from Vita Life, and Kylie's gonna try the Pick Me Up Green. So she's red, I'm green. Hers is apple, pineapple, cucumber, kale, spinach, lemon, and ginger. And we gotta have our prebiotics here. So we both got Trilogy Kombucha. Shout out to Synergy, GTs all day. Um, make sure when you get your kombucha, if you do drink it, you check for the included added sugars. GTs is the only one that includes zero. So look out for that. We got some romaine heart lettuce for the week. Super excited because that's easy for salads and sandwiches. Got some grapes for literally snacking. It's amazing. Got some clubhouse crackers for JJ. Um, and I like to throw some cheese on it myself during the day. And the cheese and crackers. And some wine. Can't complain. Got some half and half for my coffee. I'm trying to reduce my little seed oil intake. So um, fat free half and half is the way to go. Yeah, no fat. So it's, it's the best thing for my coffee. I love it. Got some bananas for later on. All week long. Kai saw this, I'm super excited. We like to use Laughing Cow as like a spreadable or just like a little snacky snack. Um, let's see, this is the white cheddar one. Oops, sorry. <laughs> Aged white cheddar. Super, super good. Um, looks, looks that way anyway. Only 1.5 grams of fat, one carbon, two protein for one wedge. So it's like, if you like your cheese and you want a cheese fix, this is how you do it. We have had this in a very long time, but you know, us Canadian bacon people, <clears throat> shout out to Hawaiian style pizza. This is really, really good because of the amount that you get on it for three slices, which is a serving size, only 70 calories, only two fat and 12 grams of protein. Yes, it packs in the sodium because it's like bacon style. So you're going to have that. But for having three slices, which fills you up and for only 12 grams of protein and for only, sorry, two grams of fat. This is, that's a winner right there. 
So we're gonna make our own little sauce today. Um, I forget what we call it, Kylie, call it, Kylie called it, a lot of season case. But got some more organic deal weed, which was a lot cheaper for what we got versus the other brand. So good to have on hand to add some flavor. Some whipped cream cheese spread, super good by the way. I've never had it until like two weeks ago. <laughs> it surprised me how good it was. So two tablespoons is only 4.5 fat, um, two carbs, and one protein. So nice to put in little big old things over there. Nice little spread. Got my coffee cream, which is gonna last me about two weeks. Got Kai's coffee cream, which is gonna last her about two days. I'm just kidding, sorry Kylie. <laughs> but I like my French vanilla. She loves her little Italian sweet cream, both zero sugar, so shout out to zero sugar. And then we have some harvest snaps. If you don't, if you haven't had these yet, these are really good to eat. This is a Parmesan roasted garlic flavor. Whoops. And this one is lightly salted, so the pretty much the OG. The macros you get for about 22 pieces, which is a lot. 130 calories, only five fat, 16 carbs, and no added sugar. So this is a really good snack to have on hand just to kind of get that snacking feeling out your mouth. Same thing with the other one for the Parmesan. For 22 pieces per serving, you get five grams of fat, 17 carbs, and five protein. So it's really good. And for the whole bag, in case you just wanted to just, you know, hog it by yourself. Only 390 calories. So, you know, I, I see it's good. good. Good little pick right there. Um, don't think it has any seed oils inside of it. Nope. Look at that. No seed oils. So it's a win-win. Boom. All right. And last but not least, got some orange juice. We got two more things. Orange juice for the mimosas later on. So really good. And then we have some candles that we're going to um, use to kind of ease us into the holidays. I'm so excited for this one. This is a weekend road trip. I wish you can smell it. Oh, it smells so good. And then we have oak moss and amber. This one sells amazing. So both by Huntington Home. I think they're like $3.99 each of these. So amazing. I think they're both three wick too. Yep. Look at that. Smell it. Oh, I wish you could. All right. So that is our Aldi grocery haul for this week. We are excited and I cannot wait to show y'all videos of doing the cheese fries. I'll take a picture of the mimosas and show you guys that and for the Rice Krispie Treats as well. Um, be looking out for the next grocery haul and our future launch for an app that's coming out here soon. So be going on the prowl for that. If you have any questions, drop them in the comments. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Thanks guys, have a good one.